In today's video, I'll be showing you how you could farm every single legendary schematic weapon in Pal World. But before we jump into the video, make sure to smash that like button, consider subscribing if you've been enjoying the content, and let's go. Now, when it comes to these legendary weapon schematics, these bosses have a chance of dropping them, and they'll reset their spawn every 60 minutes. So the best thing I'd recommend you to do, is if you're trying to farm every single legendary weapon schematic, Start doing a little farm. So you'll hit King Paka, then you'll hit Pushy, then you'll hit the Beacon, and then you'll just go in a giant circle, and by the time you'll come back, the first boss will be resetted. For our first legendary weapon, we have the legendary Old Bow, which is dropped by King Paka. King Paka could be located here, or for the coordinates, it'll be at 50 minus 458. Next, we have the legendary Crossbow Schematics, which is dropped by Bushy, and when you encounter him, he'll be at level 23. Bushy could be located here, or at the coordinates, negative 116, negative 492. Next, we have one of my favorite weapons to use. It's a legendary handgun, and the schematic is dropped by the beacon, which when you encounter him, he'll be level 29, and he could be found here. Or for the coordinates, it's negative 352, negative 261. The legendary pump shotgun schematic is dropped by Suzaku, which is level 45 when you encounter him, and he could be found here. Or for the coordinates, it's 404, 257. Next, we have the legendary AR, which is dropped by Blazamut, or Blazamut, or I'm not sure how to pronounce that. When you first encounter the mutt, it'll be at level 49 and could be found here, which is negative 443 and negative 560. And lastly, we have the legendary rocket launcher, which could be dropped by Dretragon. When you encounter Dretragon, it'll be at level 50 and could be found here. For the coordinate, it'll be negative 790 and at negative 323. 